Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode here in my time at Sandro, how do people are doing? I know it's been a while, it's been a bit spreading out there, yeah, I kind of semi-burned. So, we are flying. Ooh. Hope that's cool. To your left, you'll see the fabulous Porsche Tunnel. A joint effort. Several leagues through solid rock that connect us to our water shipping neighbors. To your right, the fabulous Katori World. Happiest place in the free city. But don't take my word for it. Take the whole family for a ride on the world famous Coaster World. Oh, <laughs> apologies for the turbulence. But what you're feeling now is only a fraction of the wind that we used to get before. <clears throat> With that, allow me to direct your attention towards the Outback Forest. Everything else! Over there is all the trees that we planted. With people like my aunt, and the builder, and Mr. Zeke, and Neon, and Nia! We've got one more trick up our sleeve, as it were. This airship is equipped with environment-maintaining technology. Incredible. Coming up now on the last stop of... What you see before you is Martel's Oasis, restored to its former glory through the monumentous efforts of our wonderful townsfolk. Indeed, what you see before you is the jewel of the Yuvala. Ah, <laughs> this concludes the tour. Now, everyone, please just enjoy the ride. It's that Greg. Cool, okay. Let's talk to today. Well, how do you feel? Accomplished. Oh, yes. <laughs> Me too. Oh, we've accomplished so much. But while this may be the end of our journey, it's still only the beginning for Sandrock. old photographs I hardly recognize myself to think that flawed person change to be the one standing here with you now sometimes things look bleak real bleak but we had each other and new friends we made along the way we pushed through we never gave up, no matter how bad it looked. And through it all, we were able to create a better world for our children. So, what's next for us? I really can't say. But what I do know is that we have earned our destiny. Every day here, every day belongs to us. of what we did because of all of us I know we made a difference I still feel the weight that comes from everything down there but it's different now I feel a kind of safety under that weight Maybe it's because I know we can carry it now. Okay, I guess this is that what was. Wow, it's been one hundred and since you got from the high winds. 
cool. That's interesting. I didn't know actually, <laughs> to be honest. Like, yeah, since the Kringleaf days, day one, summer one. We had the Logan hijack, okay, okay. And then we have the Greenhouse Defense, we have the Gecko Stations. A few days later, we have the bridge. We repaired. Did the Little Woods, the kidnapping. No bounty, okay. We had very impression with Musa later. That was. Think we had the cleanup in second year. Yeah, it took, took a minute to get there. We have the investigations. A lot of things we defend in Sandrock. That took a minute. We fought. Yeah, we built a school. Hmm. That's a crazy summer runner. Okay. We had the Katori World later. Total commission 460. Number of respects. Yeah, we didn't do too much. Total almost a million. And you spend it. Almost we spend it. 1000. Wow. So we got 20 gifts. Okay. That's, a, that's the event. We didn't do much. Probably we be, might do them. I didn't host the party. Yeah, I know that. It's the zero head and zero good along the way. 24 gifts, zero dates. Yeah, we're gonna fix that. Don't you worry, we're gonna fix that. Then the 64 trees, really? Again, I'm paying this. We go, yeah, for things to find, of course. You go missions eight times, defeat one. Oh, okay. 400 something machines, okay, relics, restore 24 of them. For the exhibition, that was a hard one. Three times to do photographs. Yeah, well. We had a long history, okay. Probably a lot of the side quest, those were. Yeah, that photo was murder. Yep, thank you all guys, like seriously, you did a bang up job. But let's go to the, to see what's next. I don't think it stops here, but at least it might be some free roaming, who knows. Alliance, summit schedule, and the sand rock, yeah. Cool. So apparently that was it in terms of story campaign. I believe there is probably gonna be some kind of uh, I don't know DLC or like something like that. I'm not sure, but it, it might be. It might be as well. But so far, in terms of campaign wise, this is what we have. We have some kind of. A, Vent there, okay, let's go in the is that the correct way? Where is this pointing? There's definitely something in here, but for some reason the quest is all messed up. Mm. Yeah, I believe that, oh, that's a bug, probably. Who knows? Okay, let's go. Okay, here. Hmm, so... Huh. Um... Hmm? Hmm. Matt, Trudy, what? Uh, rest assured, Mayor Gale. I think our... Any idea... Possibly. Oh. Sensitive to sunlight. Weakness sometimes collapses in comas condition stabilized by cactus juice yes exactly I can try a cure really no kidding yes that's wonderful news mayor Gale but she needs to come in herself oh that'd be hard but I'll arrange it 
Thank you, Doctor. A try is all we ever hope for. I'll let them know at once. May I use your telegraph, Aunt Trudy? Of course. Yes. That's... Uh, this patient will come... in a bit. Not easy to treat. Worry not. I'll... be prepared. Okay, if, if uh, Fang talked like five more... five more times more than usually. Well, so we don't have any... We still have commissions, we still have to upgrade stuff, apparently, but how far will it go that? I don't know. Of course, I'm in the first place. Like, we have uh, like five star commissions, we have stuff to do, and there is something probably that I will want to do, but it's gonna take a minute actually for that to happen. We need to make some uh, marriage stuff to happen. Yeah, and it's gonna take a minute. And of course, we're gonna go with Mian, not Mia, Mian. So, about that, so far. She's best friend, but uh, nothing too romantic, I believe. So. Probably we need to give her more st stuff, probably to to increase the chance, probably. So I need to go do that. I need to go find what she like. I need to give her a few times to do that. And uh, yeah, what is the next upgrade for this place? Of course, it's massive. I don't think we're gonna ever be use it, but uh, there is a few more things that I wanna check out before like any other update comes or any other bonus things so we, we don't have that kind of money i don't think we're ever gonna have that kind of money anytime soon like it's gonna take a minute but uh, yeah so let me gather a plan let me gather a plan and uh, see you in a bit all right everyone so i'm back i did do a couple of things just let the game but uh, it's the next day so we have a couple of cutscenes per se i believe i i need to think about it it's a celebration of love it would be wonderful to have a strong single woman who is dedicated to her career to join hello this is lee jun the mayor of Walnut Grove. We're discussing an upcoming exhibition. Ah, oh, we've met before. You've got quite the reputation. Please help me convince Amira to lend her expertise to our exhibition. Walnut Grove is hosting a ceramics exhibition to the theme of love. Amira ceramics have made quite a name for themselves. So I was inviting her to contribute some creations since I was in the neighborhood. She said she would like to think about it some more. I don't know. I've never done anything like this before. I'm not particularly competitive. And it's such a short time. I don't want to sacrifice my other orders. I understand. Busy people. Well, the exhibition is a season from now. So you have time. Be sure to join in. I understand that art takes time, but I know you can do this. You have something special, Amira. Help me show the world. Thank you for your faith in me. I will try. If I manage to finish within the deadline, I will send it over. Good. Then I shall eagerly await your work. Okay, so we had the uh, small cutscene for Emira. Uh, things. If you hear my voice, it's morning, boys. If you can tell, and uh, also yeah, we have uh, the the map. It's a bit broken apparently since the latest update, so some pairs not showing perfectly. Uh, but also we have to go and see Miguel for the last time. Yeah, we had the message in the morning, so let's go see him off actually. Life teaches us to forgive. If we can't grow, then who are we as a people? You have been sounding more like a minister every day, Virtus. Sandrock is lucky to have someone as pure as you. Well, as much as you deny it, 
I know you were always preaching from the heart. I was preaching what I believed. But even then, in my pursuit of my ideal, I ended up precipitating the very thing I was trying to prevent. I wronged you, Burgess. I led you astray. Took advantage of you. That's in the past now, Miguel. Besides, I wouldn't be who I am today if it weren't for you. For better or for worse. I can't regret the past. We can only look forward into the future. Ah, well, let me impart one last bit of wisdom to you. Sometimes, even when you're so very, very sure, you still need to reflect and ask the tough question. I have given this much thought while I have been in here. And even though I clung so hard to my ideal of an orderly world, what right did I have to force it on anyone else? That makes me no better than the fools who caused the day of calamity. You okay? I am glad to see you. Burgess was giving me one last sermon on forgiveness. I... I've seen Miguel's growth. He's not the man he used to be. He's seen the error of his ways. But... Now they still want to lock him up forever. I told you, Burgess. I seek not forgiveness. I have to face what I have done. Don't shed a tear for me. I will be fine. If I pour out your water because you poured out my water, then no one has any water to drink. I can see how much you've changed. If we let you just rot in a box, then who are we? See? Everyone makes mistakes, Miguel. Your way was flawed, but you still had our best interest at heart. Your past and some dubos lies just led you to make some rash decisions. No, you have both been a sliver of light in my incarceration. I am glad I have you both with me in my final moments before leaving to meet my fate. This isn't right. This is as it shall be. Acceptance of one's wrongs does not free one from guilt. And Burgess, don't be a hypocrite. You yourself always stood for upholding the rules. Don't make the exception for me. Thank you, truly, for being here with me. We have to do something. We can't let him go like this. Yes, I'm a stickler for the rules. I knew you'd agree with me. We can't just let sure. him suffer. We can do that. In this too. So, shall we go and... Let's go to today. Then go see what we can do. Burgess, how can I help you? Mayor, we're here to request you stop the transfer of Miguel to Atara. He's changed. Changed? I... I wanted to say he was tricked by Duvos, manipulated by Matilda. And he was. But no, he's... He's very sad nowadays. He wanted something that's not his to decide. And now that he's acknowledged the destruction he's left behind... He's broken. Uh, go on. He's not innocent, but he's also not a bad man. He was a victim of circumstances. He... Did he ask you to come here? No. He told us he wants to face his crimes. I just think it's not right. Burgess. Mayor Trudy, I implore you. Let Miguel face his punishment, but here in Sandrock, where he can face everyone he's wronged, and atone for what he's done. Don't let him rot in a cell forever. Every fiber of my being is telling me that's not right. Uh, what do you think of all of this? So even the builder agrees. Uh, I trust you. Although my gut is telling me this is a bad idea. 
I will cancel the transfer to Atara. We can supervise him for a little longer in Sandrock Prison. And then I will entrust him to you, Burgess. You can count on me, Mayor Trudy. He'll be good. I'll vouch for him. Look, we can't take this lightly. If I see any sign of him falling back into his old ways... Then I'll take the responsibility. Okay. For now, he'll work under you. The Civil Corps will come up with a plan for his punishment. You can count on us, Trudy! Prove to me that this isn't a bad idea. If there's anyone that can pull it off, it's you two. We'll make the preparations, and I'll make an announcement soon. Let's first try and get the groundwork set up quietly, so as not to make too many waves around town. You got it, Mayor! Hmm. It doesn't need just any outcome. Okay. I like that outcome. So, the game will give you a choice to keep him here. Cool. Right, that's a nice rainbow. Never see it from, from that way. Who knows? Hey, you're here. Oh. We've got a surprise for you today. I've invited Trudy to award you a medal. All no. your service at the Civil Corps qualified you for our highest honors. So, on behalf of the Sand Rock Civil Corps and our whole town, we're here to give it to you, Mayor Trudy. Thank you, Justice. <sighs> Since you came to Sand Rock, the Civil Corps has been much more efficient in just about every department. I just wanted you to know that your service hasn't gone unnoticed. This is to thank you for all your hard work and diligence in protecting the town of Sandrock. You stepped up. No one made you do it. You volunteered. This medal is a symbol of all our gratitude for everything you've done as an outstanding member of the Civil Corps. I present to you the Civil Corps Medal of Honor. Four medals. Congratulations. Almost as cool as a deputy head. I hope everyone can follow. All right, that's a wrap, everyone. Let's all get back to doing what we do best. Thank you. All. Okay, we have multiple stuff in here. Can we go back in? What a pleasant surprise. I did not expect to see you again before I left. Hmm. Trudy has canceled my transfer. After everything I have done, we should not need to hold that burden. It is moving. Even after all I have done, for Sandrock to welcome me back, to open its arms in forgiveness. Perhaps I was wrong to be so weak. There is good in men. Thank you for everything. I will pass the rest of my time in peace. I aim to do as much good as I can to pay back the second chance I have been given. I look forward to my time under Burgess's tutelage. I believe there is much I can learn from him. Thank you again. For everything. Mm, yep. That was nice and easy. That was cool. And I wanna see the... I'd say it takes a minute to load. Uh, we can only have one. It's okay. Uh, we have full stamina, but yeah, that was uh, some a few things there that happened. Uh, I'm looking for Mia and I cannot find her. Yeah, because she's all over the place. Cannot find her. I don't have the perk to know where she is. So yeah. Uh, it doesn't look like she's in here, so maybe she's in here workshop, maybe. Let's go take a look, or else I need to find her. I have a plan, kind of, so probably I'm gonna do a little bit of work outside of the game. There are still things that I need to plan, 
to happen before. Can officially say that we finished this game, but for now, yeah, I cannot find here. So, so yeah. Apparently, I need to find me, and I will find her. I will, we, we will see. Don't you worry. I know where to find her. Potentially. So, but for uh, as a uh, semi final episode, it's not a final episode, but uh, as a final campaign episode, because we com completed the campaign and a bunch of side quests, and uh, we technically finished, but we have still things to do. Uh, this is gonna be for this episode, and here it is. Yep, I found you. Great. So. I cannot to give myself. Well, don't let me. So I have a gift, actually. Of course, not of that. Thanks. I love. I think we need to go. We need to go do like se semi play thing in order to do what we want. So, uh, that's gonna be for me for today. Uh, for this episode of my time at Sandrock. We will be back. Don't worry, we have a couple of episodes, or at least definitely one more. But for sure. So don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button and I will see you in the next episode of my time at Sandro. Have a great day people. Bye.